1945. A spark of inspiration rises over the ashes of post-war Poland. On April 15th of that year, the first issue of Pesekroi is published. The magazine has accompanied Poles for eight decades now. In communist Poland, Pesekroi was a phenomenon created with wit, beauty, lightness and color. Its circulation reached nearly one million copies. This is where Poles could read about jazz, learn about yoga, develop an interest in cycling, skiing, or Eastern philosophy. The most original Polish illustrators published their works there. Its pages were filled by the most inspiring Polish authors and future Nobel Prize winners. It offered advice on how to dress with style in spite of the empty stores. It taught kindness towards others. The Shakuri once devoted a full year to the work of Picasso. Each issue was accompanied by the most famous illustrated character in Poland, Professor Filitek. All this while dodging the regime's censors. Peshakuri also served as a window out from behind the Iron Curtain. Its founders traveled to the West, bringing back new ideas, as well as groundbreaking works by top foreign artists. Peshakuri has earned its cult status. It's said to be the only such magazine for 800 million Slavs. Russian-American Nobel laureate Joseph Brodsky specifically studied Polish so he could read Peshakuri. Today, it continues to select the most relevant subjects for a wide range of readers. However, its role in the world has changed significantly. There's no longer a need for Peshekri to be a window to the world. Anyone with the internet can access everything immediately. What is needed instead is a lens that points to what's valuable. The Polish word Peshekri means cross-section. We believe that almost everything necessary to live well can be found within ourselves. That's the ideal we want to share with the world. At Peshekuri, we carry on the tradition of wit, lightness, and color. Only now with more focus on what's delightful, uplifting, and essential for conscious living. We practice breathing and mental balance. Recall the most inspiring ideas. Explore life-giving movement, the wisdom of plants. And we never forget the bigger picture, an awareness of the self and of others. At a time when flashy headlines compete for clicks, we focus on enduring issues, providing an alternative. We're an organization that is not for profit. There are no ads here. We're not a part of that race. We operate with the conviction of catching one's breath and feeling one's own rhythm is the priority today. If you share these same values, we invite you to read Pishakroi. Oh, and you no longer need to learn Polish. We now come to you in English.